You want to change your skin in Minecraft Java Edition? Let's do it. First things first, you'll need to download a new skin. There's tons of different skins out there, um, but in the description down below, we have a link to here, minecraftskins.com, which is where you can get tons of different skins, search for them, find a lot of different skins. I like this uh, night skin here that I've searched for, and so I'm going to go ahead and click on it, and then you can click download here and download the skin. Um, it'll download automatically after a few seconds. If it does take you off to something like this, do not click download on that. It's kind of kind of weird there. Click download again and the skin will download. The file you download should be a PNG and it should download directly from Minecraft skins. It shouldn't take you off to another page like that. Nevertheless, with that downloaded, I do want to mention you can make your own Minecraft skin. A link to this is also in the description down below. And once you're here, you go over everything you need to know about creating your own skin. And there is obviously a in-depth video guide as well. So if you want to customize the skin and make it your own, you can do that as well. But at this point, we have our skin. And before we install it, how about a message from our company, Simple Game Hosting? Go to the first link in the description down below, the breakdown to XYZ slash SGH to start your very own 24-hour DDoS protected Minecraft server for you and your friends. You can use the mods, plugins, and mod packs, and customize the server any way you want. Plus, there's expert live chat support there to help you out. So go check out Simple Game Hosting at the first link in the description down below, the breakdown to XYZ slash SGH, and start your Minecraft server the simple way. Nevertheless, we now want to go ahead and open up the Minecraft Launcher, because this is where we can manage all of our skins. To do that, you want to go over here to the Skins tab in the Minecraft Launcher, and every Minecraft skin is here. There's even default Minecraft skins that you can easily switch to by clicking Use when you hover over them. Boom, that's now my skin. But you want to add a custom skin, so let's go ahead and click plus new here. You can name this anything you want. We'll go ahead and name it Knight, and then you can choose your player model, wide or slim, and then we can browse for a skin file. This is going to be that file we downloaded. It should be a PNG, as I said. Right here it is. Double click on it, and it will select it. It's a pretty good skin. You can also select your cape here as well. Wow, this goes really good with the migrator cape. Solid skin here. Once you've got it, you can go ahead and click save or save and use. If you did click save, you have to hover over and click use to activate your skin. And it's that easy. Now when we go ahead and jump into Minecraft, we can jump into our simple game hosting server and quickly spin around using F5 on the keyboard and see our skin is going to in fact be active. So if we go ahead and press F5, there it is. There is our night skin. Let's go ahead and uh, drop that FOV down some. There we go, look at that. Now, if you wanted to change your skin, you can. You can go back and change it to anything you want, and the skin that you saved will still be there. Now, I would recommend backing up any skins that you love locally somewhere, because I have had skins removed from the skins tab in the Minecraft launcher unexpectedly before. So if there's a skin you really, really like, make sure you keep a copy of it. But it is really cool, because now we can come over here, and obviously I don't want to be this night skin. I want to be the skin that I always use here. So we can go ahead and select that. It'll now change to that, and once we jump back in-game, we can see that this skin is now active. So there you have it. That's how you can change your skin in Minecraft 1.20.6. If you've got any questions, let us know in the comment section down below, and be sure to give this video a thumbs up if it helped you out. We'll see you in the next video, and I'm out. Peace.